Good morning. Long time no talk and I literally look awful, but I am doing something. It wouldn't be my video if the dogs didn't work. So, um, I am doing some, hold on, I'm watching, um, YouTube <laughs> and I forgot to stop playing it. Er. Okay, well, I guess the remote decided to die. Um, so I'm doing something today and I wanted to come on here and talk about it because I think it's fun. Um, so I can kind of record it. I did miss breakfast and I forget I'm looking at the viewfinder. It's been so long since I've done this. Um, but I am doing like letting my Instagram followers control my day. So I voted this morning. Um, if y'all think I should eat an omelet or this chicken maple sausage that I really like and whether I should have a LaCroix or a Diet Coke. And y'all picked an omelet, or they picked an omelet and Diet Coke. So, it's going to be something I try to start doing more often because I think it's kind of fun to, like, see what people think. And then that also gets me to, like, switch up what I eat and stuff. So, I'm going to take you all along for that and kind of show you what people are picking. So, we had an omelet and a Diet Coke for breakfast. Watching a little Earl's fam on YouTube, which is where I got the idea from. And... Next is, should I wash my hair or put it in a cap? And it is, it's pretty dirty. So I'm hoping they pick wash, but we'll see. So it's been a long time since I've been on here. It's been a long time since I've been on here. And so I wanted to get back to it. I miss y'all. And life has just been crazy with, you know, the last video I did, which has been like seven months, which is so crazy. The last video I did was explaining about cotton and rosemary getting shut down. And so it's just been, it's been a really rough year with that and trying to get that back up. You know, when you go from like almost 40,000 followers to like less than five, um, that's really hard. And so I've been just putting everything I have back into growing that. And honestly, just like feeling defeated. And so just haven't been in the mood to vlog. But I'm getting back into it. I'm getting back into eating better because it's just been a whirlwind with summer and my birthday. And we've just been eating terrible. So um, <clears throat> I'm doing Weight Watchers again, which obviously y'all are going to be like, Kelly, you're crazy. Like you don't have that much weight to lose. But I'm just one of those, like if I have like, I'm like a checklist person kind of so it's there you like check off what you eat and you have so many points and then when they're gone they're just gone so that works good for me um so we're gonna try that out I haven't weighed myself because I don't want to get frustrated so I'll keep you posted it's my friend Taylor she's doing it and she's doing really good so she encouraged me so I'm doing it with her so shout out to Taylor so we're doing it together um, she's even sent me like a good website that has some good recipes and stuff. So I'll try to share some of that with y'all. <coughs> I'm not sick. I have really bad allergies and I've been helping Joel cut grass and stuff because my dad had um, a full knee replacement and he normally likes to help Joel on the weekends. It's like their time together. Um, but he had full knee replacement so he hasn't been able to go. So I'm the new helper, and I'm extremely allergic to grass, so I like to take all week to recover, and then by the time I recover, it's like time to go back again. So, that's kind of what we've been up to. Um, my car's been in the shop for, initially it was in for five weeks, got it back, drove it for like a week, totally shut down while driving it, like lost everything, had to tow it. That was tragic. I was so upset. So now it's been there for five more weeks, but it is ready. So actually I think Joel's going to get that today, like on his lunch break maybe. So I'll be so excited to have a car back, y'all. It's terrible. I've just been using my mom's car. Um, sometimes I drive Joel's other truck, not his like, you know, I don't, well, I guess I'm not sure. We have so many cars, y'all. It's terrible. Um, so I'm going to be so excited to finally have my own car back um, and just get back to life and vlogging and being myself. And I feel like with everything going on in the world right now, with all the stuff that's happened in Afghanistan and, you know, COVID, the Delta variant being back, 
I've just found myself to be like extremely anxious and like kind of I don't want to say depressed because I'm like I'm genuinely like a happy person I'm not moody but like this has just really been messing with me lately and being like anxious and so tried to find myself you know being more intentional with my prayer and like who I'm praying for what I'm praying for so it's just I feel like I've just been in this funk you know the world is just I feel like it's a scary place and I'm having to like constantly remind myself that God's in control and you know there's nothing I can do about it all I can do is you know pray and take care of my family and you know just try to make the best decisions that I can so it's just been a lot you know and I'm sure a lot of y'all you know you're feeling the weight of it too you know you might have family members in the military and you know you're scared that they might be deployed and you know, everybody's seen it from all kind of different aspects. Um, and, you know, COVID and worrying about that. And, um, you know, so I know everybody is, honestly, everybody is facing a difficult time right now. And, you know, I feel like all, you know, everybody's on edge. You know, I was talking about that with Joel the other day. Like, I feel like everybody is just, like, ready to explode with the way that the world is. So, try to be, try to find yourself when you're out, like, if somebody honks at you or they're rude, like, just try to think, okay, you never know what they're walking in life right now, like, what their life looks like, and I'm trying to find myself doing that, because I can be one that's like, they were rude, or, you know, and you're just like, okay, you never know what's going on at work, you never know what's going on at home, so I'm trying to be more careful about that, especially just knowing how much is on people, so... Try to be, try to show people a little more grace right now. You know how, you know how difficult it is to get people to work right now and how, you know, we've got like several restaurants over where we live that are closed, like Panera's closed, Moe's has been closed. I'm trying to think, there's something else that's like, it's not even open. Like we wanted to DoorDash Moe's one night and like it's not even, like the restaurant wasn't even open because they can't get enough people to work. And so it's just crazy times. So, um, if you're going through something right now, comment down below. Um, I would love to add you to my prayer list um, so that I can not just say I'm going to pray for you, but I actually remember to pray for you um, because you can never have too many people that love you and you can never have too many people that are praying for you. Um, but that's enough of like just sad things. I'm so excited to be back on here. Um, and how to do better about vlogging. Um, it's hard. Sometimes I feel awkward. I feel like whatever I'm doing is boring and lame. But, you know, it's life. It's my life. And if you want to watch it, great. If you don't, that's fine too. But I'm so thankful for all of y'all that do enjoy watching that are here. Um, so, I am going to check and see what they said about washing hair. Hopefully they did wash it. And I even think I might put some makeup on today. So, I'll see you in a little bit. And hopefully I'll look better. I told y'all I would look at least a little bit better when I came back on. So, I know I told y'all that I was letting Instagram decide my day. And I, I, I put up there whether I should wash my hair or wear a cap. And it was like almost half and half, but it was still winning for me to wear a hat. And you know when you just like, when your hair is like, it's that dirty that like you can't even stand it? Like it had to happen. So I promise I'm going to do everything else that they say for the rest of the day, but I'm just going to do it. But I'm wearing this cotton and, my cotton and rosemary Florida sweatshirt. I love it. I have a large on because I just want it to be super oversized and comfy. So um, I'll put the link um like I'll put the link in the description box because we only have a few left and a few other ones too. So, and they're super on sale. So y'all should snag one. They're really comfy. They're Gildan and we still have some of the like t-shirts and stuff, but those are all comfort colors and those are on like really good sale too. So. All right, y'all. So it's definitely later. Kitchen's definitely messier. Um, went to the chiropractor. I do got another meeting for something else. And if you hear the people in the background, they're here washing our cars. Um, but I just kind of wanted to come on and end this just because the rest of the day I have my niece Emma here and I'm just going to try and spend some time with her. Um, and uh, I'm going to de finish decorating for fall probably because y'all voted 
they all voted yes on my Instagram when I asked. So I'm going to head to do that. And so this is just kind of like a welcome back, kind of telling y'all how I've been feeling, kind of like my mental health state and everything. So I love y'all and I can't wait to be back. Uh, drop a comment below, say hey, and let me know how I can pray for y'all. Bye y'all.